Haven't made a video in quite a while, but I've been busy cleaning up the game room. Again, rearranging things. Finally got um, frame frames for some posters that I had from long before. See now I can put up my Gonzalfi poster. And I just need to fix this frame here for this uh, CG portrait series uh, Virtual Fighter 2 poster that I bought. Just need to fix up the frame and so I can hang it. But yeah, sorry I haven't um, made um, too much videos, um, but I'm planning to gear up once again um, so I can finish up all these freaking videos that I've had in mind for you know the past um, year or so. Anyways, currently I'm making some stick making videos, but before I show those, here's my arcade stick collection. I already showed this before, but this is the Sega Saturn HSS-0130 Virtua Stick Pro. Next is a Blast City based arcade stick with Sametsu buttons and sticks. This one has Sanwa buttons and sticks, but is dedicated for Virtua Fighter. Here's two Virtua Stick high grades for PS3. A VF5FS stick for 360. And a smaller Sega Saturn HSS-0136 Virtua Stick. Along with its twin PS2 Fukukuban Virtua Stick. This one here is my most expensive stick and cost me an arm and a leg. Obviously this is the Diamond Vulix. Got this one straight from Amazon Japan and its shipping was killer. Here's a closer look at the Blast City based arcade sticks. In the closet are two VF5 sticks for 360. Here's an Ori PS2 VF4 stick along with an Ori PS2 red VF4 EVO stick. This is a Konami Hyper Stick for PlayStation, along with a Sega Saturn Real Arcade VF Dash Stick and a Sega Saturn Real Arcade VF Stick, both by Hori. Here's another Ori VF4 Stick, along with Ori Red and Blue VF4 Evo Sticks. These are two Sega Dreamcast Arcade Sticks. These are brand new Ori Rap and Rap Kai for both PS3 and 360. Another wrap for PS3 with some buttons and ball changed for Virtual Fighter colors. This here is an H-Tech Dreamcast arcade stick modded for both uh, DC and PS2. Ah, this here is my homemade Catch-22 stick, the first stick to use Sanwa parts outside the arcades. In fact, I was the one who started the whole consumer sticks to use Sanwa parts. More on that later. But you can see just how bust up the stick is, so I'm gonna have to restore it. This is a Capcom stick for SNES, which I got back when I was still living in Arizona from, I believe, uh, Funko Land uh, from the mall. Found this Tekken 5 Wrap EX arcade stick from the Salvation Army for $8 about a year ago, and I'm gonna modify this guy and uh, put some VF graphics on it. Two more Blast City bases with Sanwa parts. And finally an Astro City Candy Cab base stick. My next video is actually going to be on how to make and wire this stick. So um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Take care and aloha.